amigos, amigas from the Lake Chapala Society. And I've been a member here for two and a half years and love it here. Uh, and here, the president of the Lake Chapala Society is going to tell us a few things about what goes on here. And this is a privilege to be talking with him again. So here he is, Steve Buffer. All right, thank you so much. It's great to be here. It's great to have you here with us. Um, I'm with the Lake Chapala Society and the president of the organization, Steve Balfour. And we people know some of the things we do, but very few people know all the things we do. We have over 100 activities that take place here on our campus. And amongst those are our Concert in the Park series, uh, which took a little hiatus for the past month and a half. But um, generally, it's two concerts per month right here at the Lake Chapala Society. We also have eight annual events, which today we're at one of those annual events, which are Music Fest. And it took a little hiatus for a couple of years because of COVID, of course. But now it's back in full bloom. You can see it's a full crowd here. We have some delicious fruit from the smokehouse over here on the one side. La Pasena has a table here. Bach Alados, the ice cream store, new ice cream store in town, they're here serving their goods. So, and of course, there's a bar. But we really encourage people to come to any of our events that take place here at the Lake Chapala Society. And we think you'll have a really good time doing it. We're very friendly, open arms, open hearts. Um, coming up, we have this one here. We have a tequila tasting coming up. We have a, working on a possible tour to tequila and a whole bunch of events, as well as our concerts. We have the three tennis from Puerto Vallarta that are coming next Sunday, followed a week later at the Lakeside Little Theater. We have a show called My Way, which is music from Frank Sinatra, Paul Anka, Tom Jones, and a lot of the favorites there. Uh, and uh, Nacho, who puts on that show, really does an amazing job. So we hope you'll come and visit us at one of our events, or just any day of the week. Come on over and just see our lush gardens. Take a tour, walk around. There's docents here that can give you a tour, or you can just roam by yourself. Our gardens are open to everyone, free of charge. Thank you. Okay, thanks, Steve. This is, uh, uh, I'm really happy I caught you to do this interview, and uh, anything else you'd like to say, Steve? I, I think just come and, come and see what we're all about. We have a monthly magazine also, a website that talks about our things. But I think really coming here, we have pottery classes, we have an amazing children's art program on Saturday mornings, and it's really the membership of our, mostly, most of our members are expats, as we refer to us, uh, from United States, Canada, uh, London, all over the world. And it's the membership fees that make many of these things possible to allow us to do free classes in art and photography. We have chess classes on Saturday. We have English classes for students locally, um, as well as, as I say, over 100 programs for expats as well. And serving the community. It's, it's all about collaboration, working together. That's why we love the fact that we're going to be doing a fundraiser with the uh, with him for the Lake uh, Lakeside Little Theater coming up real soon on the 24th. Okay, thank you. Thanks again, Steve, and thanks for doing this interview. You gave us a lot of information. All right. Thanks for all the hard work you and, and everyone else does here at the Lake Chapala Society. And thank you for what you do. Okay. Have a great day now. Okay, take care. Steve.